My name is Leonard Muhebi, Muganda, and I am a, a dairy breed inspector. And over the last nine years, I've been training farmers who have been uh, keeping dairy animals. And also, I've been working with the Livestock Breeders Association as one of the uh, consultants in data management. Uh, today, we are going to go through over a number of modules to help a small-scale dairy farmer on how to start and how to grow in a successful business in dairy farming. Ever ask yourself whether dairy farming is a profitable venture? Today, there are so many farmers who have been keen and have been divided with choices on whether to start a dairy farm and what it, it entails. Um, dairy farming, uh, as any other business, requires a lot of effort. And that means that for you to be a dairy farmer, there is no holiday that you have for a whole year. A successful dairy farmer must make sure that they have a good plan to start and have a, an objective when uh, raising their animals. A good dairy farmer should also be aware that the kind of uh, enterprise that they are starting should be run as a business. And gone are the days when uh, dairy farming was done for subsistence. We are now having farmers who have ventured into dairy farming in a small way and have made bigger profits for their business. And today I'm going to take you through an online training course for smallholder dairy farming. And our topic today is an introduction to smallholder dairy farming. And we have a number of topics that we're going to uh, go through during this course. First is an introduction about dairy farming. Having thought about starting a business or starting dairy farming as a business, then this is the right uh, video for you to watch. Under introduction, we are going to talk about what you need and what it takes for you to become a successful dairy farmer. We'll also be looking at how to start a dairy farm and we shall be giving out tips on how on what you need to consider to be a successful dairy farmer. We shall be looking at how to succeed as a dairy farmer and what it entails to carry out dairy farming as a business. We'll also be looking at dairy breeds of animals that a farmer should keep. Many farmers have asked questions about which breed they need to keep and today we'll be confirming to the farmers which breed are suitable within the environment and how to choose a, a breed that suits and meets their uh, environment and their needs. We'll also be looking at the dairy breed management. We want to uh, inform the farmer on how to best raise their breeds so that they are able to maximize on the production and what they expect from the farm. Uh, we shall be looking at proper dairy housing. Housing is a very important uh, activity that a farmer should be able to consider and farmers should put in place a proper housing structures for the animals. Calf rearing is another uh, challenge that farmers uh, are having on the farm. We shall be going through uh, during this course how to rear and raise the calves in a proper way. We shall also be looking at feed and nutrition. We want farmers to know how to properly feed their animals uh, with the good quality feeds and uh, this will ensure that uh, farmers also uh, keep animals that are productive and they can enjoy the benefits of the uh, high production or high yielding animals. We'll also be looking at record keeping as one of the main uh, pillars of a successful dairy farmer. Any farm enterprise that uh, has no records cannot uh, be able to plan well 
and make decisions of the farm. And so we'll be covering uh, a number of uh, key aspects under record keeping. We'll be also looking at disease control and management. What are the diseases that are prevalent and that, that affect the animals and uh, that a farmer should be prepared to control? Lastly, we shall be looking at the mar at marketing and other economics. We want any person who wants to venture into dairy uh, farming, especially the smallholder farmers, to run this business, uh, to run the enterprise as a business. And that is what uh, we want the farmers to consider. We'll be looking at the key issues that a uh, farmer needs to consider for a successful uh, uh, business of a dairy farmer.